What is happening YouTube, it's your boy Tech Tricks back with another video and today I'm going to show you how to take time lapse and motion time lapse on your DJI Osmo Pocket. Here we go. First things first, make sure to hit that subscribe button below, hit that notification bell so you can be notified the next videos to come of tips and tricks on your iPhone and your Android. Check out my merch below at 1130.ca. Check out this hyperlapse of the legislature building as well, I'll link that below. Here we go. First thing you want to do is hook up your DJI Also Pocket to your iPhone and make sure that you have the DJI Memo app and you'll be able to have all the settings that you want for your DJI Also Pocket time lapse. Once you've done that, make sure to select time lapse on your DJI Mimo app. And now you'll be able to have all the settings that you want. From up here, you'll see the interval, the duration as well. Whatever how long you want it, you'll be able to select that to your liking. With the interval and duration, this will determine how long you want your time lapse to go for. Now, what is the difference between me using my phone time lapse and the DJI Oslo Pocket? The best part about this is having the path of travel of your time lapse. So you can have your DJI Awesome Pocket automatically travel from left to right or right to left or whatever path you want it to go. With the DJI Awesome Pocket, it has a maximum of four paths. So here I'm going to select my first path and then I'm going to move my DJI Awesome Pocket head and select my second path, move it again select my third and then move it again to select my fourth sometimes if your interval and duration is not long enough then it won't allow you to select the fourth path but for the most part i've been i've gotten away with just using two paths so once you're done selecting all that then you'll be able to press record and it'll move by itself automatically as you guys can see on the video and that's it. That's the easiest way to take time lapse, motion time lapse with your DJI Awesome Pocket. Well, that's it for today, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this little tutorial on how to get motion time lapse and time lapse on your DJI Awesome Pocket. Make sure to hit that subscribe button below. Hit that notification bell as well so you can be notified in the next videos to come of tips and tricks on your iPhone and even on your DJI Awesome Pocket. Check out my merch below at 1130.ca. I'm going to show you as well a few footage, so stay tuned till the end. And I hope you guys have a good day and stay grateful. Peace.